I have something. Um, uh, maybe a week ago, um, I just received some really clear information and um, got together with Riku and we um, started working on a table. And um, it was really interesting because it was <laughs> another really um, intricate table with a lot of information. Um, it was interesting to see that we both received really specific information um, about ourselves, then about the code searcher group, and then I um, there was a whole area in it that was developing around the altar, um, all the temp the temple the abomination and um, what goes around that. So um, I worked on about five different tables that brought me to this particular table, going from one to the next and getting information. Um, and let me just share my screen. Okay. So, what I came up with was, let me move this over a little bit. So, um, Sophia means wisdom in Greek, and uh, there's no mistake that they pick that name. Um, but when I started looking at that, um, so my name and my last name are here encoded at a skip of one that's the light blue um i always check just to see when i have a couple of uh names this is in the book of daniel i just looked in daniel um to find out what this beast thing is so um the first thing i put in was uh the red and white which is demons um hashadim um and then Hashair, which is uh, in the red and black. And then the adversary, Hasatan, is also in the red and black. I just try to keep all those like in a theme. Uh, oops, wrong way. I always move this thing wrong way. So. Um, Satan is in here. Um, and through here, he actually appeared all over the place. But so we have demons uh, appeared once, uh, another type of demon appeared another time, and then Satan appeared a bunch of. Sorry? No, no, it just your screen flickered. You always didn't see anything there for a moment. Oh, okay. Um, all right. So. The next thing that came up was abomination, and that's in the green, green and blue. So I imagine it's this one, the light green and blue. Yeah. Um, and then it runs across this way as well. Um, then I looked at disembodied, which is in yellow and blue. It's right here disembodied and we know that, that um, the demons are the disembodied spirits of the of the giants um, then I looked for sacrifice and sacrifice was orange and white and it came up here and then across this way and the orange and white and then this way um, then uh, prophet went through this way in the black and white, and then it, 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 it's in here twice or three times. Here it is again, the prophet. Um, then days of Noah, uh, it's the purple and white. So let me see, purple and white. So days of Noah. Here's, um, so it's a meme, Noah, and it's right here. 
Um, and then mixed offspring is in the pink. You see it right here. So it's a hybrid. And then here. Um, it was up, up there pretty significantly, actually. Um, and then I put harp in the white. So uh, I have harp going through here in the white. Um, and it's there once. And I have something, oh, yeah, uh, something else was in the white before, but I erased it to clean it up. Um, then um, when I looked at something that I found out is when, and every time I get a term, I will look at each of the places where the letters appear. And when you write all those down, it tells a story. Um, so when I looked at harp, um, it spoke about, um, it started out with, I know for certain, oh, uh, it starts out with, uh, tried them for 10 days. Um, I know for certain that you would gain time is the next one. And the next letter is blessed is the name of Elah forever for wisdom and might is his. And then the next one speaks of its legs of iron and its feet of iron and clay. And the next one, uh, where Sophia is also and in, in intersects with harp, it says, um, and in the days of these sovereigns, the Elah of the Shamayim shall set up rain, which shall never be destroyed, nor the rain pass to other people. It crushes, it puts to an end all those rains, and it shall stand forever. So from what I'm seeing is uh, Satan's trying to set up his reign. Um, something that's been really coming up uh, in all of my tables is the scroll of uh, John, the little scroll. And um, that is in the fuchsia over here and over here, going this way. And then, um, so fuchsia, uh, this way is little scroll or scroll and then here's john johanna so it's right next to each other um okay so then i decided to put in obama uh because he came up uh in some other tables pretty strongly as well sorry about that and um obama is in the brown and white so uh it starts uh, here, no, yeah, here, here, Obama, and I think he appears twice, yeah, here again, Obama, oh, he appears four times, actually, now that I remember, here, um, and actually, that's not, a, yeah, it is, Obama, so um, what I was finding out, uh, so, what, what it says about Obama is, now, O Sovereign, establish the uh, verdict and sign the writing so that it, it is not changed according to the law of the Medes and Pers Persians, which does not pass away. So um, after I read that about the Medes and Persians, um, I got the, and the sovereign gave orders, uh, the, the next letter in Obama said, and the sovereign gave orders and that brought those men who had accused Daniel and, um, and their children and their wives. Oh, and they threw the children and their wives into the den of lions and the lions overpowered them and broke their bones to pieces before they reached the floor of the den. Um, so just keep those two in mind. Um, then the next letter in Obama says, a stream of fire was flowing and coming forth from his presence. And a thousand thousand served him. 10,000 times 10,000 stood before him. The judge was seated and the books were opened. Then the following letter says, this is the end of the matter. As for me, Daniel, my thoughts greatly alarm me and my color changed. And I kept the matter in my heart. Um, the next one says, and the male goat is the sovereign of Greece, and the large horn between its eyes is the first sovereign. 
So I went in and looked at who the first sovereign of Greece was in uh, the mythos. And that um, god was Uranus. And Uranus's father was Ether. <laughs> um, the really interesting thing about that, it was the first generation of Titans. And Ether, when you think about it, is the person personification of light is how they described him. And he is the prince of the power of the air, basically, ether. Um, it's the primordial god of the air. Um, and his sibling is Nemesis. And Nemesis is Nibiru. Um, so uh, that took me to Ephesians 2.2, where it says, And you were dead in trespasses and sins, in which you once walked according to the course of their world, um, according to the ruler of the authority of the air of the spirit that is now walking in the sense of disobedience. So when I looked into ether a little bit more, um, and a lot of stuff has come up about time travel, Montauk, this is all the stuff that brought me to this particular table. Um, it's, uh, uh, it shows Ether in a battle with a lion, actually, uh, when I looked up Ether, that, that was the picture. It was, um, I can't remember who the artist was, but that's the most well known statue of him. Um, so he's a, in a battle with a giant lion, which I thought was very interesting considering what, um, what's been revealed and with Paula's table as well. So then, um, as far as the quanti particles, um, I, when you look at quantum particles and, and um, time travel, there's what's called quantum entanglement. That's when two particles seem to be connected, uh, no matter the distance between them. And the, the space where they're connected, that vacuum in between them, um, is called the quantum vacuum. And that is what is also known as ether. Um, so I found that really interesting and in relation to time travel and to Montauk and to um, Philadelphia Experiment and to MK Ultra and I mean all these things have come up um, monarch programming all in relation to that so um, uh, It is the equivalent in modern fi the quantum entanglement is it the is the equivalent in modern fix it um, physics to ether um, and uh, when I looked up how to uh, spell ether, and I'll show you where it is on the table. Ether is the khaki and white. So wherever you see this khaki and white, there um, and there running through and here and up here. Um, and then just to show you something else, um, the quantum is in the blue and pink, this one. And here. Um, so the when I looked at the father opening the door to the Shamaim, he, it, it spoke about speaking, uh, opening the door to ether. So um, that is uh, kind of an interesting connection because what I saw in my other table, and I'll, I'll be able to show you guys that next time, is the fact that what Obama or Obama. what um, the Antichrist is trying to do is to set up himself at the altar. And we know that um, in order to try to enter that gate that opens to the Shamaim and um, set himself up as, as God, basically. Um, and I have a lot more than I can bring in the next time when I present the other table um, that'll kind of bring it all together. But I just thought that was really interesting. And this all came out like an hour before the meeting um, from other tables that I've had. Um, the beast is in here. Um, Uh, where, did, where is the beast? Oh, it's this green, this uh, light green. No, no. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. 
so it's this one. And then it goes along this way also. So, um, and then Obama, of course, everywhere. But it seems like he's uh, going to be indwelled with something at some point, for sure, by looking at where the indwells are and the demons and Obama. Um, and that's pretty much it. Very cool. So is this, um, is this, in, this is exclusively in Daniel, right? Sophia and reading? Daniel, yes. I had a skip. Right. Um, um, what was the skip? Very interesting because Daniel in, in itself, the book itself, has a lot of the end times. So you're going to find Obama everywhere because um, he is the spoiler of the end times. He even probably had a hand in setting up and signing off <clears throat> on some of this um, technology that we're seeing come out on, on the scene now. Very good. What was your skip, Deanna? Was it 400? Um, the skip was 400. 400. It only showed up twice in Daniel. So there's still another table to be developed there. <laughs> so this is all in Daniel. It's really interesting because we were just hearing a verse in there about um, clay and, and uh, the iron that did not mix. And this yes. has been here some is being part of the AI um, community. But, uh, this is what what the uh, ten toes is. is. It ten toes, the two feet of iron and clay. It's the two feet. Yes, ten in ten. fact. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. No, I was just specifying the the uh, what that was. Very good work, yeah. I 